Hey there, Sensei Mish here with Artisan Martial Arts coming to you with a brand new episode of This Old Dojo. So, uh, when we pull up the carpet, this brown yellowish stuff, that's glue. Some of it's tacky, as in still kind of sticky, even though it's old glue, it's still tacky. Down there, it's like really, really bad. Like if I stand in one spot, it's like all of my effort trying to pull my shoe up out of the glue. So even though I'm putting down wood flooring in the entryway, I'm just gonna put the mat right on top of the floor. So I need something to seal it. Now, I uh, uh, in a previous episode, uh, you may have seen me fill in uh, the little holes where the tiles came up. Um, I'm still, I still have mixed feelings about, should I really have done that? Was it a good job? Was it a bad job? Well, more not bad or good job. Was it a good idea? I don't know. Anyway, it's done. You gotta live with it. So, anyway, now it's time to paint because the mortar is dry. Um, I have four gallons of this stuff. Uh, this is a concrete and garage one part epoxy coating. Now, this is not a garage, and this is that stuff is actually designed to go directly onto clean, unoily uh, cement. So we're not really following the directions, but when it comes to putting down a coating, after talking to some people, I'd had this idea, after talking to some people, they were like, eh, you could try. <laughs> so kind of looks like this is my best option right now. So anyway, so uh, one of these cans is about 500 square foot. Uh, it's supposed to say it's supposed to be 500 square feet. Um, I've got about 1,000 square feet to paint. So I got four cans because I might need to do two, uh, two coats. If I can do, do two coats, then that's great. It'll be a nice hard shell or whatever it ends up turning into. But, um, and if I don't, then I'll just take the others two, other two back. So it is what it is. Anyway, um, I did have to get this colorized to match the other cans because they, even though Home Depot said, yeah, we have 12 in stock, they only had a couple. So I bought the colors I needed, got the other ones colored to the same tint. So anyway, let's get to this. Oh, oh, forgot to mention, um, I'm just gonna keep the camera in one spot. It's on the super wide angle lens, so you've got the entire thing. Now it will look like I'm playing Grover near and far because that's really not that far away. It's only about 50 feet, but I don't want to move the camera. I just want to paint this and get it done. So now we can get to it. restaurant over there. I've got like a Thai place down here and another Chinese or some other restaurant down there. And of course, you know, you've got your pizza, round table pizza, all that kind of stuff. But right now, I don't know who makes it. I don't know what building comes out of, but I smell fried fish and it is so good. Like, I don't know what it tastes like, but the smell is intoxicating. I might my back door open. Oh my God. Uh, if I could say, hey, we train in martial arts, we do this, and we have the best smelling fish in the world. Now, don't know why you'd go there, but 
Anyway, thought I would share. Kind of excited. It's not the best dragon in the world. Probably not the best tool that I should be using to seal this up. But um, I know in about four hours, I don't even know what time it is. Let's see what time it is. Uh, uh, it is currently almost seven. So eight, nine, 10, 11. So I'm gonna be back here about 11 o'clock because I, I want this part to be dry and this is the last part that I did. So I want this part to be dry. So I'll be back in about four hours and uh, we will see, we'll see, I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> I'm so tired. Hours later. Okay, four hours later and it's dry. It's not tacky anymore. I've kind of walked around. It's, I think it worked. Um, however, I think it needs a second coat. I just wanna make sure it's nice and solid. I'm, um, I've still got a little bit left in that second can. And then of course I'll dig into the next one and we'll go, but I think I actually have enough to redo a second coat on here because from what you're not seeing on the camera from from here in just a little bit is going to be some wood flooring and then there's a section where there's not going to be any wood flooring and I talked to my talked to my wife about it and I think we'll just go paint that just like we did here because it's the same tile um, uh, so then we'll have like this uniform look the tile eh, tiles not bad but I don't know, I just kinda, I kinda like this. I kinda like this look. So, anyway, on to a second coat. I don't step on the wet paint. I hope ever you can see me. Um, finish with number two. Now, one thing I ran into is further on down there, it was still a little bit sticky, but we're still looking at four hours worth of uh, um, dry time. And I think my shoe itself has some sticky stuff on it as well. So uh, we're gonna let this dry. Uh, I'll probably be back tomorrow morning, maybe about eight hours from now, um, or more, 
But uh, yeah, there we go. There's coat two. I think it looks good. Um, way to go. So if you've hung out this long and you have not liked, subscribed, shared, done all that really cool social media stuff, um, do so now. We'll see you on the next episode. And also go over to Facebook, look up Artists and Martial Arts. If you're not following us there, follow us there. Uh, Sensei Mish on Instagram, all that kind of stuff. So see you on the next episode.